Baby, don't check for me. Taking time out to be and live my life off screen. Taking time out to be and space on the side which is something that you don't see all the time I don't know the last time I've seen parting like this on the side because usually it'll be interrupted by a, by a track look at that so I'm gonna do a side part on this I have my wax stick I'm gonna let y'all watch me style this really quick. how the hair looks styled part on the side y'all know this unit can be worn glueless which we love that sometimes I will use a little bit of glue here but everywhere else I use the spray to lay down a little bit of the baby hair y'all seen I use the wax stick I use care care heat protectant I use the chi but really nice unit very soft and I'm pretty sure that this hair can be curled. I can test it for you guys really quick because I know somebody's going to ask. Just to show y'all really quick, I'm going to use a flat iron. So the hair can curl. Y'all see that? And then let's straighten it back out. This is some really nice hair. They have really, really nice hair. I've had some curly hair from them before too. And it was really, really nice. So... 
love this unit it's really pretty i really like this a lot this is really cute and nice thin lace on this unit i've told you guys before when the lace is thin it melts really really well so i love this it looks really good so if you guys are interested in this unit i'll have all the information along with the discount code in the description box below Hey guys, it's Sharika. Welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe before you leave. Today is Wednesday. I am getting ready to run some errands. I sold two pair, three pair of shoes. So I sold the gray and red pumps and the black boots and and two weeks so i'm getting ready to send those off i have to do the return for my amazon shoes the loafers that were too big and then i need to go to the mall to pick up my jeans let me show y'all my outfit i'm wearing my saint laurent dupes from amazon my little Bottega dupes from amazon my jill sanders shirt this bag is from cos I'll probably do a side by side so y'all can see. Jeans are from American Eagle and then I'm just wearing my little mesh flats. So yeah, those are the errands that I have to do today. I was trying to wait for this one girl. She asked me if I had the black and the 1B and 33 mixed wig still available so i was trying to wait on her so i could just go ahead and just send everything out but she still haven't got back to me and it's been like an hour so i'm gonna go ahead and just send this stuff out i don't know what i'm gonna put the shoes in let me put sure y'all clearly... tell me why i forgot the earrings to take back to zara i think i'm gonna just keep them <laughs> so i'm pulling up to the UPS store right now. I'm gonna go this way because so I can let this car out. Pulling up to the UPS store, dropping the shoes and the wigs off, and then I am headed to the mall. That's done. Now I'm going to the mall. I brought my Louis Vuitton perfume with me because I was gonna stop by Louis Vuitton and get my bottle filled up. I've never did it before, so this will be my first time doing it. But I have heard that you can do that. So, and I think it's supposed to be like half the price or something like that. So, we're going to try it and see if I can find a parking spot. Because, girl, I do not feel like walking. It's 83. I mean, I'll walk, but it's so hot outside. So, it's 83 degrees. So, we'll see how I feel after I leave the mall. All right, y'all, done. Got my jeans from Miss Lola. I still haven't tried them on, but we'll try them on at the house because I, I just don't feel like it. It's that time, and baby, I just don't feel like it. So, I'm gonna go ahead and, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go ahead and stop by Louis Vuitton to get my perfume filled because I didn't spend that much time in the mall. I did walk around um, H&M and I tried on two pair of pants. I didn't really like the way that they fit. So I just left. I ain't even like get a different size. <sighs> and I'm out of breath. So We'll go ahead and I, I kind of want to stop at uh, Home Goods, but I'm not going to do it. Yeah. 
on. I got so many compliments today on my outfit and it's just like so simple. I got compliments on my earrings, my whole outfit, my hair, my shoes. I have on my little mesh flats. It was so nice today. The girl in Gucci, she was like, oh my gosh, don't you look chic? I'm like, thank you. Girl, that's the whole vibe. That's what we going for. <laughs> got the perfume refill my bottle of perfume i think that perfume is like 400 and it was 250 to get it refilled i got my jeans i did go on gucci to look at some loafers the ones that the black ones that i picked up those are new they just came in today but they only had a 39 and in that loafer because it's so narrow i told y'all i need to go up to a 10 they didn't have a 40 in store um then she brought those other ones out the chunky ones with the real bottom y'all know i don't like those but i still looked at them but y'all know that i don't like those and she said they'll be getting new stuff in up until the holiday time so i just keep checking to see if i find something that i like louis vuitton if you guys are in jacksonville they remodeled. It's so cute in there. The way that they have it. It's so cute. It looks completely different. They have more clothes out. It's really cute in there. I like that setup better. And she said that, I think she said this week they'll have another part um, open. So it's really cute. Like it's, it's really cute. So let's try on the jeans. And let me show y'all these jeans that I'm wearing. Because I get a lot of questions about them. These jeans here are from American Eagle. And they do have a little bit of stretch. I like to get mine in a bigger size. So this is a size 14. They do fit really big. Um, they're very 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 stretchy but they fall on me nice so i haven't got these tailored or anything like that i can pretty much wear american eagle jeans straight from out of the store and yeah so love these i've had these for a while okay let's try on the ones that miss lola took in the made well jeans these are my made well jeans i love the way that they fit they do have a little bit of gapping still but i don't mind it because i didn't want her to make the waist too tight um and i won't be wearing like a shirt that's tucked in y'all remember it was like way out there so it's still just a tad bit but it's fine so i love the way that these jeans fit on me like they look so good I love these. What y'all think? I think they're really cute. So yeah. And I only got the waist taken in. I didn't mess with the bottom. She charges $25 for the waist and $20 for the bottom if she has to take your bottoms up. Love these. These are really cute. <laughs> While I was out, two more pair of shoes sold. So the leopard pair and the pink pair are longer available. And then the last wig was also sold while I was out. So let me show y'all the perfume. This is my favorite perfume. This is my first time getting a refill done. And this is probably... Well, I have a couple of other perfumes that I've finished, that I've repurchased. But this perfume, y'all know, this is my favorite perfume. It is by Louis Vuitton, and it's called Les Sable Roses. Every time I wear this perfume, y'all, every time I get so many compliments. This smells so yummy. Screenshot it. So good. I would say that this is a good blind buy. I don't know the notes on this and I can't really describe it to you, but it smells amazing. Go to your nearest Louis Vuitton store and ask for a sample. Spray it 
and watch how many people compliment you. It smells so good. It's worth every single penny. <laughs> so y'all, I got a Amazon package in. When I was at the restaurant this weekend, I went in the bathroom and they had this little bowl that had just like a unscented candle just sitting in the bowl and it looked really cute. It was very simple, but it was really cute. I love that melted candle look. Now y'all know I've done this and this and this, but I wanted something just really simple that I can kind of float around our place. So maybe sometimes I can have it in the kitchen. Maybe sometimes I can have it in the bathroom. So I ordered something from Amazon. I haven't seen it yet in person. Hopefully I like it. So let's open it. only one that I have on hand which is this ribbed one it's really cute um, this one doesn't really give the melting effect like I want it to so that's why this one is not being used and I don't have it in one of my little glass containers but just to show the vibe I'll put it in there but we'll probably go to Ikea tomorrow and grab one but it is a perfect fit let me just double check to make sure because I have so many candles. In my little candle container, <laughs> but it's just mostly the little tea lights. And then I got these little jumbo ones right here and then some cords and stuff. I need to clean this out. but. Hey y'all, today is Thursday, it's Halloween, and it's lunchtime. I am having a lazy day today. I try not to do nothing, but that never happens. Um, I just got back in from Chipotle to vinaigrettes because they always give you like less than half. On my Chipotle bowl, I got the smoked brisket and queso. <laughs> this is my first time trying the brisket, but me and my husband send each other food all day long. And he showed me something that somebody got from Chipotle. So I was in the mood for Chipotle. I like to eat mine with the sweet and spicy chili Doritos. Y'all know these are Tony favorite Doritos. So... This is what I get. I get a half a spoon of brown rice, black beans, um, pico de gallo, corn, queso, cheese, lettuce. She could have gave me a little more lettuce. And vinaigrette. And then I scoop half off. Let me get a paper plate. I do half, just cut it down the middle, and I'll do half now and half later. Today is Tony's final football game. Oh man, I made a mess. Let me eat this. Mmm, that's spicy. That brisket is spicy. So yeah, this is how I usually do mine. Half now, half later. Y'all see this is a lot. And then I scoop it with the chips. So I'm going to put this part in the refrigerator. And then I'm going to pop this in the microwave because I like it to be a little hot. 
and that's it. Happy Halloween, or are y'all gonna watch some scary movies tonight? I think I will if I'm not too tired after the game. Good morning, happy November. Y'all know this is my favorite month, my birthday month, Thanksgiving, my favorite holiday. Sometimes me and Thanksgiving would be beefing a little bit because it's so close to my birthday. But I do love Thanksgiving. So happy November. I am getting ready to go run some errands. I gotta go to the bank. I have to go to the post office. I have some Amazon returns that I need to make. So I'm gonna go ahead and knock that out. And then I need to hurry up because I have a nail appointment this morning again. Black Girl Vitamins, I've been telling y'all about this for months. I feel like I just got my nails done. Look how grown out. The last time I didn't cut them down and I gotta get them cut down, but the link is always in my description. Y'all can choose the ones that you guys wanna get. I use the D3 and then the hair, skin, and nail vitamins. So, but y'all can make y'all choice on what y'all wanna get. You will get a discount. I have a discount code. Use it, take your vitamins, okay? Putting all the girls on. I'm getting ready to use my Fenty treats this is a hydrating strengthening lip oil you guys probably remember when i got this probably like last year but um the day that i did the closet clean out i also cleaned out some of my products and stuff just organizing and stuff and i found this because i completely forgot that i had it so it's so pretty it's a gloss like a clear gloss but it has a little bit of tint to it Me and my little sister got this. I think my little sister put me on to this. It's so pretty. It has your lips feeling so hydrated. I really like it. I don't know if they still sell this. I guess they do. Um, but see how it looks? It's just a little bit of tint to it. See that? Not very much, but it still goes on clear. But like I said, it does have like a little bit of color so pretty um, and then after that i need to go pick up some seafood for my mukbang i'm gonna do a mukbang tomorrow and i'm gonna have a special guest and we're gonna have some good conversation seafood and cocktails of course so that's gonna be fun um, so I got a busy, busy day today. I also have to put this vlog out for y'all. Um, I know somebody's going to ask. These glasses are old. Y'all know I have these in maybe like three or four different colors. I have the all black. I have the one with the red or the pink tint. I have the brown tortoiseshell ones. And then these are another pair of the black with the brown tint. Giving very much Tom Ford. So yeah. Um, I will have these linked in the description box. They're probably on my Amazon storefront though. I really need to update my Amazon storefront because I haven't did that in a very long time because I've been using LTK a lot. But I do need to update my Amazon storefront because I be finding some cute stuff and sometimes I forget to just add that to the storefront so y'all can just shop whatever I've recently purchased. Maybe we'll do... A video on my recent Amazon purchases because I've been shopping on Amazon a lot like us all I'm sure um, I do plan on putting my Christmas tree out this weekend um, Tony has to go pick it up from the storage and y'all know last year I did two Christmas trees I did one in my studio and then I did my one up front I'll pop up a couple of pictures right here so pretty as always I have to pat myself on the back because I do such a good job. <laughs> no, it was really pretty. But y'all know my old Christmas tree. I have to manually put that Christmas tree together. It's a lot. And I wanted to get rid of that Christmas tree. Um, because I just. It's, it's a lot. But it was cheap. Y'all know I bought a 12 foot Christmas tree. 
from at home for like a hundred and I think like eighty dollars. I've had it for years, but I bought it for a really good price. The only thing about it is you have to manually put the branches on and it takes a very long time. Everything is color coordinated, but it still just takes a while to put everything on one by one. It was a good deal, but I bought the um, Y'all know they had the viral Christmas tree that went out last year. So I bought that from uh, Home Depot. Now, I wanted the one that had the twinkles, um, but they didn't have that one was already out of stock. So I bought the closest thing to it. But I love my new Christmas tree. I got it from Home Depot for like, I think it was like $700 last year. Really pretty. Kalila has the actual viral Christmas tree. Hers is like... Um, an eight foot tree, I think, like eight or nine foot tree, but it twinkles, it's really pretty. And those Christmas trees, to me, in my opinion, you don't need to put anything on it because it's just so pretty just by itself. So last year I left mine, just the lights, it was so pretty. And then I did the real pretty gift wrapping. I did the giant ornaments up under the tree. I'm gonna do the exact same thing this year. I know I got my red reindeer, so I'm so excited. Now, I probably won't do like the um, all of the ornaments and all of the things until maybe like after Thanksgiving um, or maybe like the end of maybe like the middle of November. That's when I do that. But for right now, I just want to have my Christmas tree out. I don't know. I just feel like I don't get enough time to really enjoy it because it's so pretty to me and I just like it. So I'm going to put mine out this weekend whenever Tony goes by the storage to get it because I can't pull that big old box out by myself and put it in the car. That's just not going to happen. And I had that Christmas tree delivered. So there's that. So yeah, let me go ahead and get my day started. Like I said, I'm getting ready to run my errands and I'll pick y'all back up when we get to Louis' spot. This is pretty. This would be cute to hold your vitamins in or salt. This is cute. I don't really care for this part. for this color but I really like this style this is so cute I haven't seen this anywhere mm, and they have a set Ooh, should I <laughs> Still have more things that I have to do because I forgot to go. Well, I did look for the little single um, candles, unscented candles that I want to use for my little bowl that I bought, but they didn't have any at home goods. I thought they usually had those little candles, but they didn't have any at home goods. Here's my nails. We did do a little cut down, which I know that's not going to last too long, and I got. My favorite red, which is Big Apple Red by OPI. And I had to get the lamps. They're so cute. They have this, um, I don't know if this is green or blue, but it's so pretty. This gives a cute little vintage vibe. I couldn't leave it. And then it has the green marble at the bottom. These are so cute. I really like this. I like the vintage look. So this will be cute on my nightstands. And then it has a little, I, this is like my favorite thing on the lamp. Y'all know that I love a pool chain for the lamps. It's just it really does it for me. So I got to put light bulbs in, of course. Uh, but really pretty and these were only $49 how much $49.99 each I wish the glass was like an amber brown but I can decorate around this color 
So I think it will be fine. And then I want to say that the picture in my room does have a little bit of green or blue, green and blue in it. Cause I'm not sure. I think this might be a green. Does it look green to y'all? And then because this is green, so I think this is green. Which I don't mind it, it's cute. I like this, I'm happy to have them. So I still have to, um, the seafood spot, I was gonna go to Erica seafood spot, but they didn't have the king crab in there. Um, I'm happy that I called because it's far away from me, but she was like, call to make sure that they have them. They didn't have them. Ryan said that they had some at the Rose. I have purchased some for Rose before, but they don't have them all the time. But Rain said he went in there, I think yesterday or the day before yesterday, and they had them. So I'm going to go up there. Hopefully they have more. And then I'm going to stop by. Should I stop by Ikea? Oh, I can go to, I'm going to go to Hobby Lobby because it's, I can, yeah, I can go to Hobby Lobby first and then go to, I'm trying to make sure I don't go in a circle. Um, yeah, so I can go to the seafood place first and then go to Hobby Lobby on the way back and get like a little single candle for my little bowl. So yeah, that's what I'm going to do. I am tired. I feel like I want to take a nap. <laughs> and I did take my vitamins today, but my energy seems so low today, but that's all right. I love y'all so much. Okay, give me a hug, girl. Here, come on. Bring it in. Bring it in. Bring it in. You ain't spray on no perfume today? That's okay, baby. I got you. <laughs> I still love y'all, okay? All right, y'all. My camera, I still have half of my bowl from yesterday. I low-key want some fried fish tonight. <laughs> So I don't know if I'll eat this. I hate wasting food, but I've been waiting all week to have a piece of fried fish. So we'll see. Oh, look y'all, this is like what the restaurant had. They had something simple like this. I could have came in here and got this one. This one was $5. Do a few of these. They're fifty percent off, so they're like ten dollars each for under the Christmas tree. Growing up, my mama used to put these in the windows <laughs> when she would decorate for Christmas. She decorate real cute too. Oh, that brings back so many memories. That's so sweet. Oh, feeling sad. I love a cute Candyland Christmas. I think it's so cute when people do that. I'm looking for the big ones. Um, I want some this size right here, but all red. It looks like they haven't put them out just yet. Oh, look how pretty this is. This is so pretty. That is so pretty. Yes. Yes, let's do it. <laughs> Crab legs look pretty too. Okay, we'll do this one here. Mm -hmm. I will do this one. This one. I'll probably get more than four. This one. Do this one. This, yeah. We'll do these these three right here. Mm-hmm. This and this. Mm -hmm. 
I like that big claw back there too. Yeah, let's get him. Oh, he don't have all his legs. Okay. <laughs> we'll do this. This one. And that should be good. This. Yeah. Okay, y'all. I'm back. And I bought the wreath. It's so pretty. It's in a cart. And I bought the glitter gift boxes for up under the tree. But those things are in the car right now. So let me just show y'all what I picked up. I had this one right here in gold. Um, but I bought it in red. It just says Merry Christmas. I love this font. So I'll probably put this like in the kitchen or somewhere like that. But it's so pretty. It has a little bit of like black paint around the trimming um, on some spots. But it's okay because everything was half off. This was... $10.99, so half off of that. Um, and then, y'all know every year I have to get the little cocoa, hot cocoa bombs. I like to use these little candy bombs for like my coffee and stuff like that. It's just a cute little vibe. So cute. I remember when these first came out, I fell in love. So I get them every single year. So I was at the register. I saw these. First of all, I love these, but I'm going to just keep these out on the counter um, once I put up my Christmas decor and stuff, if I don't eat them all, but I love these. If you guys have not tried these before, try them. They're delicious. Matter of fact, I think I have them. <laughs> they're so good. So good. And then, they had these little can y'all see them? the little gingerbread wooden spoons i just use these to mix my coffee um tea whatever they were ten dollars half off that so they had some really good deals this week i don't know when it ends but y'all need to hop on it if you guys are into decor hobby lobby this time of year is my favorite time to shop in there because they have the prettiest christmas stuff in there so y'all know i'm not a big hobby lobby person i like to go in there for their florals um and then i'll go in there for some candles sometimes but around this time like holiday season is the best season they have all the pretty things out they're putting out all of the ornaments right now they don't have the giant ones out yet but i did see some like at the top of the shelves but they were still like in the little buckets so i'll go in there just to see if i can find some bigger than what i have already um and also at home but that that's really far from me um but i'll probably go over there too they have some really cute christmas stuff in there too but it's always the same thing every year so uh, i would recommend hobby lobby over at home because you just never know what you'll come across in hobby lobby but in at home, like I said, it's pretty much the same thing every time you go in there. They don't really switch it up too much. Um, had to get some super glue because y'all know my reindeer antler broke. So I got to get that together. And then what is this? Oh, this is the little bowl. This is a little simple bowl. And remember I told y'all that the restaurant that I went to, it was like just as simple as this. Like it was just a small little simple dish that they had the candle just melting and it. I just love the vibe. And it was brown too. So y'all know I was in the gap. But um, I found this one. They have this one in gold, black, white, and then I think like a clear glass. So I just grabbed this little black one. And this one was half off. It was $4.99 half off of that. What else? I ended up getting a basket because I started. Once I walked on to the other side, I just saw a bunch of different stuff. Then I got a little small black candle. And it'll still give the same little melting effect that I like. Um, this one is scented though. It's called Onyx, but it's a very light scent. So I don't think it'll bother me too much. I'll probably put this in my son's bathroom and I just bought one just to see if you know I like the vibe where's the dish yeah, 
So, of course, I'll take the wrapper off. But I think that's going to be a cute little vibe for my son's bathroom. So, yeah. I got that. And then I bought this size right here for my bowl. Um, this one was already marked down. So, I paid $6 for three. And let's see how this one look on the the little tray. So if I wanted to do it like this, and I know it's simple, but if you're into vibes, <laughs> then you get it. Okay, that's all I'm gonna say. So three for five ninety nine, and then I bought this one. I like this size too because I didn't want them too tall. Like the ones I have some in my bedroom that I have in the glass jars right now. And those are so cute. Um, but I wanted some that was a little shorter. I didn't want them too tall. So I got this one. And this one was $7.99 half off. This is expensive. $7.99. I didn't even know it was $7.99. Um, and this one is coconut. Creamy coconut. But it's very, very light. So... And then, I'm trying not to slip back into my candle fetish, but the sleeve on this candle was so pretty, I could not resist. So I had to find one that I like. Look how pretty this is. Look at that. It's so pretty. And the one that I chose was the Timber and Patchouli. It smells so good. It was only one left. I, I even asked the lady in the back. I'm like... Do y'all have any more of these candles because I wanted to get a few more? This smells so good. Go to your Hobby Lobby and smell this scent. It smells so nice. Timber and patchouli. I love patchouli, by the way, so this is right up my alley. But this is so pretty. They have a lot of pretty different ones. Like if you, you know, whatever color that you're into. They had like some cranberry colored ones. Um, I saw a pink um the clear of course they had a lot of different ones so and they were on sale so this was $15.99 half off of this or maybe some of this stuff was 40% off and then, this is probably like a dipping bowl but I like the little teacups is like this I like to drink my coffee out of and I like just holding it like this I think it just looks so cute so I like little cups like this and like I said it's probably like a dipping bowl but I use these to drink my coffee out of when I just want a little espresso shot so I got the black how much was this this was $1.79 and 40% off so I got it in black and then I got it in this little taupe color. Now y'all know I have the ones that look like the Nespresso cups that someone sent to me. Um, and I love those. And then I have a taller one. It's a little bit taller. It's probably, probably about this tall. Because I like the ones that don't have the handles. I just like the way that it looks just holding it like this. I just think that's so cute. So um, I have a few in there but i wanted to get some more so i love this got these two colors my favorite colors so yes y'all that is it for today's video i hope you guys enjoy hanging out with me don't forget to like share and subscribe follow me on instagram i am sharika b and tiktok sharika b too and i'll see you guys on the next one oh